In Philippine boxing, Romero Duno scored a big victory in Miami, Florida over the weekend, stopping Jonathan Perez of Colombia after two rounds. Duno stunned Perez in the second round with a right straight and then followed up with a body with a series of body punches. With his left arm allegedly hurting, Perez did not answer the third round bell, rewarding Duno with the win that improved this record to 24 and 2 with 19 wins by way of knockout. Bill, your take on this fight? I think it was really an impressive uh, win for Duno. And I'm so happy that our own uh, Ryan Songalia was yeah. there and actually captured the, the fight on video. Uh, these are the moments when you, when you see the, the, all the hard work paying off. And for Romero Duno, who's actually sacrificed so much by staying in the U.S. Yes. All this time. Talagang uh, panahon na siguro na mapansin siya at makilala siya lalo na mga kababayan natin. Dahil uh, wag natin kaliligtaan, no? dahil sa pandemia, you know, a year and a half has gone by and a lot of these guys have disappeared from the radar. Mm-hmm. And we've never heard from them. And, you know, in the Olympics, we knew that a lot of our athletes were training abroad. But in boxing, since they don't really represent the country, You don't know. Somebody just disappears from the newspapers and you don't know what's going on next. But in this case, Duno made an emphatic uh, return to the ring and I'm very glad that we were there to catch it. Mm-hmm.